Exoplanet climates are one of the most fascinating frontiers in astronomy and planetary science, offering clues not only about distant worlds, but also about the potential for life beyond Earth. To understand how these climates work, scientists rely heavily on atmospheric modeling and simulations that predict how heat and energy circulate on these alien planets. These models are crucial for interpreting limited observational data and for assessing the habitability of exoplanets. One particularly intriguing aspect of exoplanet climate science involves tidally locked planets, worlds that always show the same face to their host stars, much like how the Moon always faces Earth. On such planets, the star-facing side experiences perpetual daylight, often leading to scorching surface temperatures, while the far side remains in constant darkness and bitter cold. This extreme temperature contrast could create fierce atmospheric winds that work to redistribute heat between the two hemispheres. However, the effectiveness of this heat transfer depends on the planet's atmospheric composition, density, and rotation speed. Cloud formation also plays a significant role in shaping an exoplanet's climate. On the day side of a tidally locked planet, high-altitude clouds can reflect stellar radiation, cooling the surface and potentially making the planet more hospitable. On the night side, clouds may trap infrared radiation emitted from the surface, helping to prevent the dark side from freezing completely. These cloud dynamics, often simulated in global circulation models (GCMs), are vital for determining whether a planet falls within its star's habitable zone, the region where liquid water could exist on the surface. Another major factor influencing climate is the greenhouse effect. Gases like carbon dioxide, water vapor, and methane can trap heat in a planet's atmosphere, much like they do on Earth. Depending on the concentration of these gases, a greenhouse effect can either stabilize a planet's climate or push it toward extremes. For instance, a runaway greenhouse effect could turn a potentially habitable planet into a Venus-like inferno, while a weak greenhouse effect might leave it too cold to support life. Ultimately, understanding exoplanet climates helps astronomers assess which worlds might be suitable for life. By studying atmospheric models, cloud behavior, and greenhouse processes, scientists are gradually learning how to interpret the environments of planets light years away. This knowledge is essential for prioritizing targets in the ongoing search for habitable exoplanets and, possibly, extraterrestrial life.